Yeah, well, Phil Neville not looking quite as uh, fresh as Michael Gray, um, but both of them looking a little bit fresher than George Riley from Five Live, who's just joined me. Um, uh, George, 49 minutes, how was it out there? Uh, it's nice and cool. I, I didn't break sweat at all, actually. Uh, no, it was hot. The support was, I've got to say, was absolutely unbelievable. I, at the start, I found it really tough. Nothing in the legs, and it was really hot. But, it's like I did the London Marathon four weeks ago. It's almost as, like, as good as that. The crowd just absolutely fantastic, brilliant event. I, just, I really, really enjoyed that. I can say that now. 60 seconds ago, I hated it. Now, I absolutely loved it. I, and talk about what it does to the event and to, to the emotions you have out there when you're running for something, as you did, very close to your heart. Well, it keeps you going. I was running for uh, my good friend Steve Prescott, a former rugby league player who sadly left us in November. And, Whenever it gets tough going round, I just thought back to, to Steve and he was doing ridiculous events and challenges like this when he was terminally ill. So I'm thinking, well, if my legs are hurting, what, what must he have been going through? And immediately that registers. You look all around you and you've got people running with tributes and names on the back of the T-shirt. And it does, like, you, you get a bit tearful running around. It does really keep you going. It kind of pushes you towards the end. Well, nice job today. You've got a bit of work still to do, I think, for the highlights. Yeah, I've got to go and do a bit of highlights and then I'm uh, getting over to the Etihad Stadium for the Magic Weekend Rugby League for a bit of that later. So, yeah, I might try and squeeze in a drink before that. Don't tell anyone. Nice one, George. Uh, well, as you can see, the, the finishers are streaming through now. Uh, one runner will be waiting a long time for, I would think, is Humphrey the Bear, the mascot for the Royal Manchester Children.